can just uh, kindly sit down. I have uh, requested Ilain mo lang. How can I die if you keep on covering me? Excellencies of the Diplomatic Corps, National Defense Secretary Delphine Lorenzana, and other members of the Cabinet, Lieutenant General Filimon Santos, Jr., Chief of Staff of the Armed Forces of the Philippines, former Flag Officer in Command, Vice Admiral Robert Emperidad, the newly installed Flag Officer in Command, Rear Admiral Giovanni Carlo Bacardo, officers and enlisted personnel of the Philippine Navy, other distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen. And may I add, uh, to all of the armed forces of the Philippines are here. I am glad to take part in his honoring Admiral Robert Emperidad for his successful tour of duty as flag officer in command of the Philippine Navy. Your tenure at the helm of our Navy will be remembered for fostering a dependable and credible naval force that our maritime nation can truly be proud of. Let me take this occasion to acknowledge you more than three decades of professional career in the armed forces of the Philippines. And on behalf of a grateful nation, I thank you for your remarkable service, sir. Under your leadership, we have increased our naval presence in the Philippine waters, deterring various threats to our national territorial integrity, defending our sovereignty from foreign elements, maintaining peace and order in Mindanao during martial law, and protecting our people against terrorism, smuggling, and human trafficking. Your most recent efforts in spreading humanitarian assistance and disaster in response to operation of our compatriots working in Iran and those affected by the eruption of Ta'al volcano vividly attest to a faithful adherence to military professionalism and selfless dedication to duty. I also recognize your full support for AFP modernization program, which seeks to provide our men and women in uniform the necessary equipment and skills to, access, to excel in their role as defenders of this nation. As the Philippine Navy sails towards under a new leadership, I trust that you, the officers and personnel of our Navy, will rally behind your incoming flag officer in command, Rear Admiral Giovanni Carlo Bacardo. Under his leadership, May you all remain steadfast in your protecting our country against all threats in the seas. Admiral Bacardo, I am confident that our Navy under your leadership will continue to achieve more milestones in the campaign to protect the freedoms and democratic values that we hold dear. It is my hope that will become the embodiment of integrity and valor as you lead your Navy in securing the seas and the future of our land.
let me assure you that you will have my full support. And this administration will always assist in enhancing the capabilities of the men and women of the Philippine Navy as we pursue a more peaceful future for all. Together, let us embody solidarity as we, share, as we sail on towards a more stable and a prosperous society. I thank you for your service at Mabuhay Tayong Lahat.